The Great Stink Exposed. Parliament fled London because of the stench. Yes, the summer of 1858 was so pungent that the British lawmakers couldn't handle it anymore. Imagine the mighty River Thames transformed into a festering sewer, its banks lined with heaps of waste. The heat wave only made matters worse, turning the air into a suffocating blend of decay and filth. This wasn't just an inconvenience, it was a crisis. The Great Stink forced politicians to confront the dire state of London's sanitation system. Up until then, human and industrial waste flowed freely into the river, unchecked and untreated. It was a disaster waiting to happen, and the unbearable smell finally pushed it to the forefront of public concern. The situation was so dire that cloth soaked in chloride of lime was hung in the quarters of the Houses of Parliament. But even that wasn't enough to mask the overpowering odor. The crisis led to a groundbreaking solution, the construction of a comprehensive sewer system designed by the engineer Joseph Bazulga. This ambitious project would not only cleanse the Thames but also revolutionize urban sanitation. The Great Stink was more than just a historical oddity, it was a turning point. By confronting the mess head-on, London set a precedent for cities around the world. What started as a nose-wrinkling nuisance ended up sparking a sanitation revolution, making urban living cleaner and healthier for generations to come.